We're going to put axles on so no matter where you're at, you can drop them in and then make changes afterwards. Um, we're going to start by going to our primitives, grabbing a cylinder. Lincoln. Okay, you can see I don't want my axles that big. So I'm going to change my radius on the bottom. I'll go, yours is going to be different, but somewhere in here. That looks reasonable. And then I got to change my height. So I'm going to go to like three, and I can change that afterwards. It will automatically center to your tire. And you can just click it on. Now, we probably don't want it hanging out like that. So we're going to click on it again. Our move menu will pull up on the bottom. Click move and drag it across. Now this is where you get to make some choices. You guys have your rims cut out. If you want to, you can make it so that that wheel sticks, that axle sticks out in the center of your rim to kind of look like where the lugs would bolt on. Or you can hide it inside of there so that all you see is the axle underneath. So I'm going to hide mine because this car does not have rims. And I'm just going to hit enter. It's still not the right length. Okay. But that's where our smart scale comes into place. You can grab the little yellow one on the end. And just drag it in. Once you get it to where you want it to be, green X or green check. Okay, so we're going to submit our assignment. So we're going to look up the snip tool. It should pop up. We're going to click on it. It gives us a menu. I'm going to go to mode and I'm going to go to a full screen snip. Okay. There it is. Looks good. I'm going to hit save. And you can just call it side view or whatever you would like. I'm going to save mine to my desktop. So it's readily available. You guys probably can't save the desktop. It's probably going to make you save it to downloads. And save it. Okay. Then you can exit out of your snip tool. Rotate it now to the bottom view. Get it nice and centered on your screen so I can see your axles. Good. Once again, I'm going to go to my snip. New. It's still in the full screen. It took a picture of it. It looks great. Gonna save it. I'm gonna call it bottom. Oop. And it's saved. Good. Close out of my snip tool. When you guys go to Schoology, click on this. Here is the new one. Picture of car drop off. Click on it. No one has submitted yet, but up here is going to be submissions. You're going to click on it and select submit a file and drop those pictures in there. I have a question. Do buildings do those too?